just found out you had an eating disorder or you suspect you might have an eating disorder, I'm going to tell you three things you should do. This is your starting place. This is your what to do now. And I hope that you'll follow these three things. So first up, if you suspect you have an eating disorder, if you are a minor, reach out to a trusted adult. Tell them that you think you're struggling and that you should see a professional. If you're older than 18, tell a parent still. Tell somebody. That should be the first step. Don't do this alone. I know there's a thought that I got myself into this. I should be able to get myself out. But there's this inflection point where it goes from this sort of innocent dieting, whatever it was for you, to full-on eating disorder, which is a mental illness. So please share with somebody. That's number one. Minor, share with a trusted adult. Ask to see a professional. If you're older than 18, please share with a friend, share with a parent, somebody, because that eating disorder lives in secrecy. The shame gets bigger and grows in the secrecy. All right, step one. Step two, find an eating disorder therapist. If you can't find one, I want to help you. Email me. Come to my website. I will connect you with a therapist in your state, in your area. They must be eating disorder specialized. All therapists are not created equally in this case. So if you're under 18, ask your parent to help you find an eating disorder therapist. If you're over 18, do a quick Google search. That's step two. Step three, stay off the internet. Stay off the internet. Stop Googling things about eating disorders, at least for right now. Instead, instead, I encourage you to buy a book on recovery, something that will help you. Buy a book on recovery. Start to immerse yourself in that language. That's going to shift things for you. So you've got three really important steps. I'd love if you'd comment on if and when and which steps you're doing. Please do all three. As a review, please tell somebody you're struggling. It shrinks the eating disorder. Even if you just comment on this video and share with me, I would be so honored. Step two, Google a therapist in your area, eating disorder therapist. And step three, get a book on recovery and shut down the Google searching. I'll link a couple books below.